We've got three stranded bicyclists. They're in vans and they have some trailers. I've got Rudy with me, my son. He's my uh, best off-road recovery guy. And then we've got Ed. Yeah, good old Ed. He's our yard manager, general get it done guy. Eric's already up there rescuing some people. There's a guy that doesn't even want us to pull him out. He's gonna wait for the road to dry out. There's five passengers up there. He told me conditions are bad. I think we got Eric coming back with people here. You guys good? Yeah. All right. It's gonna be a little bit of a pull to get out of here. <laughs> you don't have any faith in us, Ed? <laughs> it's dirty. I don't know. I haven't been in this one. We are at our destination. What's up, man? What's going on? Hey, nice XJ. <laughs> what year is this baby? Oh one. Oh one, I had one of those. Okay, what are we doing? What's the play? We need to get these two out. Yeah. So this is us. They're a whole other situation. So we can make this happen really easy. You're you're independent, right? You didn't call me? Uh you know what? The third van back called, so she knows most. Okay. And you're you're gonna be able to make it out just fine. Yeah. Okay. You're one of the vehicles we're pulling out. Okay. And you must be the one I talked to. Yes, I'm Tina. Okay, hi Tina. Hi. Uh, we've got two rigs here, so we'll pull the first one out. We'll just get to you. He's going to try to take us out here, which is probably a good choice. You. <laughs> help you out a little bit because it's <laughs> uh, okay. Oh my goodness. Seven keys in the car wash. <laughs> We're out of it. We're in the clear. Yep, you can drive on out from here. Thank you. Again, man, thank you. Okay, what's your name? Sean. Tim. Okay. Well done. the customer drive the van out. We're going to see how they do. Wow. Okay, turn your wheels all the way to the left. All the way to the right. Good job. This is a this is an awesome off-road crew. Rudy's headed back to work. Tell us what's going on. I don't know. We're going on another rescue. I got my boots on this time. We just barely got back, didn't even have a chance to wash the Jeep off, and we got called out to uh, do another recovery. This time it's an Audi in the mud up there. Full tank of gas, bad luck, uh, but we forgot the toilet paper. I think we may have. Hello. Hey. You might as well just stay in there and not get muddy. All right. All right. Don't fall over, Ed. Yeah. Okay. So I don't know what
All right, so I just got to get out of here and get turned around. And what do you think of that, Ed? Yeah, I got mud all over everything. Let's head back and wash this thing off. What do you think about them taking a car like that on a road like this? Oh, yeah. You could see it was getting bad there and it just kept going. So we got there and he was a little bit crossed up. We had to pull him at an angle, kind of put ourselves in an interesting situation, but I figured we could do it and we did. So that guy was smart because he never got out of his car. If you get stuck out here and give us a call, just stay in your car. We'll show up. We'll get muddy. Forget it. <laughs> so we didn't make it back before we got called back out. Well, this is not good. Didn't hear about the trailer. Crab walking up the road, but if it works, it works. We got those guys out easier than uh, I thought it was gonna be when we pulled up there. I was worried about the trailer. We just popped them right out, and then once we got the front of the truck in the center of the road, he was able to walk it up there. I mean, he crab walked the whole way up, but we didn't have to hook him again, so that thus worked for everybody. Did you ask him if there's anybody else down there? <laughs> okay, we're going to try to make it home now. Wish us luck. That was a big job. That was a long day. Got a little bit of the mud washed off of me. A lot of people are wondering what these people were doing out there on the Mesa in such terrible conditions. And the fact of the matter is they were up there camping. They had a big group, a big tour, and they got caught in the rain. The storm moved in too quickly and got them trapped there. The vehicles that they were in weren't just weren't capable of getting up that hill by themselves. Handful of jobs done. Another good day. Thanks for watching. This is the busiest day of the year. This is like Black Friday. <laughs> oh no, what have I done? Yeah. Ah.